The National Environment Agency is pushing for the use of AI-powered robots in the environment services industry. It's to boost efficiency and worker safety while lowering the sector's carbon footprint. Rachel Tang reports. Step aside, Wally. There are new cleaning robots in town. This one roams the waterways of Sungai Salita, scooping up to 50 kilograms of trash at a time from rivers and canals. It uses artificial intelligence to not just work hard, but to also work smart. Zig Zag cleaning is very autonomous, but sometimes there's no rubbish there. Right? With AI, our robot can recognize there's a rubbish there, there's flows in there. Our robot can go there and collect rubbish more effectively. It can also be powered by solar panels, according to its maker, robotics company Western Robot. The machine was on show at the Clean Enviro Summit, where Singapore's National Environment Agency is spotlighting new technologies being developed for the cleaning sector and connecting innovators with investors. So we brought together, first time ever, I think 40 over innovators, which is one of our largest numbers, to share and pitch some of their solutions, as well as to showcase what ready prototypes they have. And uh, in the audience, we are bringing in the investors, working in collaboration with Enterprise Singapore, as well as uh, ASTAR. It's a sign of a growing shift in the environmental services industry towards robotics and other fast emerging technologies. NEA is betting on this by funding new innovation. And it's seeing some of it bear fruit. This robot named Falcon has a sharp eye for rodents. The brainchild of researchers at the Singapore University of Technology and Design, it's made to get into hard-to-access areas and roll into tasks that may be tedious or dangerous for its human counterparts. It's built on NEA funding. So with our Falcon robots, they completely automate the workflow. Uh, deploying the robots, a, con a pest control personnel can simply control, operate, monitor the robot. Um, uh, and the robot will go into the nook and corners of the fall ceiling, looking for sc scratch marks and looking for rodent droppings. And therefore, the whole work process becomes highly productive and safe. It's innovation like this that's poised to change the way we live and clean as governments and companies increasingly look to the technology of tomorrow to solve the problems of today.